I'm not good with the memory things and I'm not great with the research things. I'm okay though. But anyway, and, and maybe I should have written this out. But people, please vote. Please look at who you're voting for and do a little bit of your own research. There's this group of people and, and they're under the moniker of ADF, I do believe. Shit, I'm sorry. Yeah, I should have written this out. But I also had this thing that, you know, if I don't do it right away, then it won't get done. So anyway, it is a religious group. And they are the, uh, the largest group in the world. And they have their fingers in so much. What did that, what did that woman call it? She's, she's, uh, from the U S right. So, uh, and she said theocracy. I'm using a word that I actually don't know the meaning of, but I have an idea. And considering, you know, it is, uh, anyway, they're trying to take over this, this religion group, religious group is trying to take over the U S and maybe your first question, if you know that I'm from Canada, it'd be, why does it matter? Because everything that happens down there, that way, comes up here. Like, I don't even know why we call Alberta, Alberta anymore. It's the Canadian Texas. Or Tennessee. Anyway, there's a whole swath of land. It's really neat, actually. It comes down from Florida, goes all the way up, and reaches Alberta. And they all vote the same way. They think the same way. It's anyway. I, I was going to just put, maybe I'll put the video in the middle of this. Maybe they won't flag it. I'll probably flag it. And this black stone. That name. Now, in in the um, the video that I'm I'm possibly going to add to this, she brings up the name Blackstone. But two days ago, I came across while well, doing my uneducated research into uh, pipelines, Blackstone, and Black Rock. Maybe they aren't trying to get off the planet. Maybe they're just trying to kill off everybody that doesn't believe in their God. Oh, just, I have so many thoughts and so many things I would like to squawk about. I'd like to be that bird right now. Sorry, just can you hear the bird? <sighs> anyway, Black Rock, Blackstone, they're groups, international groups. Tied to names that you can't really find. And if you do, it's like this little mention somewhere off to the side of something else important. I have been trying to... Last year it started with the Embridge thing. People were some flipping peeled. Because Canada did it. Canada this. Canada that. And I instantly, my hackles went up. 
because I was still on the Canada's a good place. It's not. But the other day, somebody said it again. It's Canada's fault. See? Talking about Canada again. Do you know what? Just because a building is in the country does not mean the country or even anybody in the country owns that business. Like, maybe if I'd never read James Clavel, maybe I wouldn't understand. I don't have the words. I haven't read the books in a long time. I have them on my shelf. Well, three out of five. Four out of five. Anyway, it doesn't matter. It's not just Canada. And it's not just the United States. And it's... It's the company. And if my possibly spectrum brain that thinks everything could put it together. It's not a possibility I am on the spectrum. But my mouth really wanted to say that other word, you know, the big A word. I'm frustrated and needed to vent. We're all so easily distracted from the big picture. And, uh, and I had to go inside for a hair clip. Turns out I don't. Oops, what was that? I don't know. My hair isn't as gross as it looks. It's just because I just took it out of braids. Um. Anyway, yeah, frustrated with this. Like... <sighs> they say they're going for religious freedom but a big chunk of their thing is that Jewish people aren't allowed to adopt children. They're against same-sex marriage. It's all about their own religion. If you want to believe in some invisible sky daddy, Please, go ahead. But why can't you just keep it in your own home? Or your own church? Your own community? This is colonization. Just with some pretty words in front of it. I say pretty because, you know, everybody thinks, Oh, God is good. Do you know what? I haven't heard about one God that is all good out of the thousands. Have you? Does anybody have any particular God from any pantheon that was all good? sit here shaking my head. Wake up. Please. Take the blinders off. Please. I 
I'm tired of humaning. We suck. And if you think we don't, your blinders are still on. Anyway, okay, so I'm gonna say goodbye now. Harmony, happiness, help, and help from my home to yours. God, it's just words now. When I started saying it, it was with my whole chest. And now it's more like hope for a quicker end. People are too happy with their blinders and this it's torture to watch to live in live yeah I guess I exist <laughs> anyway bye for now listen up I wanted to know who was behind all of these anti-abortion and anti-trans bills, so I did my research and what I found is absolutely horrifying and every American needs to know. In every article about these bills that I found, three letters kept popping up. ADF, over and over again. But who are they? ADF stands for Alliance Defending Freedom. They're the world's largest legal organization committing to protecting religious freedom. When they ask you to join, they say it's to defend your God-given and constitutionally protected freedoms. But it's not religious freedom, it's Christian supremacy, let me show you. ADF is one of the most organized and influential Christian legal groups in the country. They were co-founded by James Dobson, who also founded Focus on the Family. They focus on religious liberty, opposition to abortion, and opposition to same-sex marriage. When it comes to religion and public institution, one of their goals is for Christianity to be reflected in the U.S. legal system, including prayer and display of crosses. When it comes to opposition of the LGBT community, they are in favor of homosexuality being a crime. They support conversion therapy. They also oppose same-sex marriage civil unions as well as adoption by same-sex couples. That's not the only person they oppose adoption for. They also try to bar Jewish people from adopting. They're also opposed to abortion. The Blackstone Legal Fellowship is ADF's summer legal training program founded in 2000 for the purpose of preparing Christian law students for professional legal careers. And Supreme Court Justice Amy Coney Barrett was a paid speaker at Blackstone on five occasions between 2013 and 17. Here's more people that have been affiliated or associated with ADF. Florida Governor Ron DeSantis has also been a speaker at ADF events. Other public officials that have supported ADF include Ted Cruz, Greg Abbott, and Donald Trump. Anywhere you see these hateful bills being passed, ADF is behind it. The goal is to turn America into a Christian theocracy. There is so much more that I cannot fit into a TikTok video, and I encourage you to please research this. Because as of right now, they're winning. Our rights, our lives, and our country is at stake. This is a hostile takeover by a Christian organization, and they have their claws in everything. When you pull back the curtain, ADF is behind it all.